In a huge recent announcement, Microsoft has decided to abandon C and C++ and go full force on Rust. But why is Microsoft adopting Rust so aggressively? And what does this mean for Rust developers like you and me? Over the last several years, Microsoft has been taking bigger and bigger steps towards making Rust a critical part of its software stack. In 2019, Microsoft started experimenting with migrating low-level Windows components from C and C++ to Rust and stated that their early experiments were going well. In 2021, the Rust Foundation was formed, with Microsoft being one of its founding members, committing to invest at least $1 million per year towards funding the Rust project. In 2022, the CTO of Azure, Mark Rasunovich, posted a controversial tweet stating it's time to stop using C and C++ for new projects and instead use Rust for projects where a non-garbage collected language is required. During a conference talk, Mark confirmed that this is actually a policy at Azure. Mark also mentioned that the Azure team was looking at converting existing C projects to Rust. And in May of 2023, Rust officially made its way into the Linux kernel, cementing its place in one of the most important code bases in the world. But Microsoft's most recent announcement is the single biggest step towards Rust adoption we've seen, and it's by far the most exciting. Dave Weston, the Vice President of Operating System Security and Enterprise at Microsoft, recently announced that Microsoft is going to invest $10 million into developer tooling to make Rust a first-class language at Microsoft. It's no secret that memory bugs are a major security threat in Microsoft products, causing roughly 70% of all vulnerabilities. That's why Microsoft has been investing in a memory-safe language like Rust so heavily. And it seems to be paying off because Microsoft has decided to double down. This investment is a crystal clear signal of the company's commitment to the language. It will open the door for Rust to be used by the 100,000 plus developers employed by Microsoft, meaning more software will get built in Rust and more Rust job opportunities will become available. I'm incredibly happy to hear this news, but let me know what you guys think about this latest development in the comment section below. Before you go, make sure to get your free Rust cheat sheet by heading over to letsgetrusty.com slash cheat sheet. Hope you've enjoyed the video and remember to stay rusty.